Ready. So, who are you? I am Fraser. Do you, do you want my full name? Yeah, that'd be cool. Oh, Fraser James Nelson. Whoa. Yeah. Um, who, what do you work on? Uh, I work on a lot of Kmart, yeah. 7-Eleven. I'm doing some work on Ryobi at the moment. Oh, nice. Um, doing some, done some Ozpost, uh, Disney, I'm one of the people on, and a bunch of other stuff. Mainly social, a lot of digital, yeah. a lot of fun. Fun? <laughs> and what's your favourite? Uh, I like 7-Eleven. Yeah? They're a lot of fun. You can just do whatever you want. Too cool. It's crazy. Um, what makes a good copywriter? Uh, being good at the words and stuff yeah. helps, <laughs> uh, but it's mainly the ideas, like copy you can teach because it's explaining, explaining yeah, true. things. That's a good point. Uh, if your ideas are good then you can, and you can articul articulate them well, yeah. better than I did then, then <laughs> you'll be able to be a pretty decent copywriter. Cool. Um, who do you think is more important in the creative team? What, out of copywriter and art director? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, they both have their place. None of them's really more important. You can't you can't say that. Like <laughs> if you're doing something for Instagram, of course the art director's gonna yeah, kinda totally. run off with it. But if you're doing something like for radio, yeah. the copyright is gonna be more important. And totally. you wouldn't work together if you both didn't have your place. So Totally. That's it's, a good it's, point. it's it's balanced. It's balanced. <laughs> uh, do you find it sometimes hard to communicate with your art director? Sometimes, yeah. sure. I mean it depends on the the mood we're in. <laughs> but totally. at the end of the day you just need to find someone that you can take your bullshit and totally. you can take theirs and then you'll work well together totally and um, what's the biggest challenge as a copywriter grammar's tricky yeah, <laughs> <Totally>. <laughs> yeah. um i suppose it's just getting that clear articulation because yeah. like uh, trying to boil down your crazy whack job insane ideas into yeah. like a tagline Totally. It's just fucking insane. Yeah. So being able to do that's hard. And also a lot of people, like art directors, get to use the Adobe suite and that's complicated. Yeah. Because you're using Word, people yeah. are like, well, it's not really that dream. <laughs> and sometimes it's a little hard to get the actual impact of it through. Totally. Um, do you think opposites attract like thinking out loud and a quiet person? Or do you think it's important to have the same working style? Ooh, yeah. cool one. Uh, I don't know. I suppose it's whatever works. Yeah. Like if you've if you've got a quiet person and a loud person, the loud person could just be yelling at the quiet person the whole time and they're sitting there like, mm -hmm. <laughs> my ideas are just trying to go with my ideas on your own. But um, if it works, then yeah. do it. <laughs> and what do you and Laura? What are you? What are uh, we're both pretty loud. Yeah. We're both pretty intense. Too um, cool. which sometimes means we butt heads, but we yeah. usually it usually works because we both know what yeah. decent ideas are. Too cool. Um, do you compliment your partner and their deficiencies? Oh, like compliment, like tell her like, she has nice hair. No, or... no, no. Like I'm um, complimenting the fact that if she is low on, you know, coming up with a word that you come up with a word that she's thinking of. Like, oh, do right. you equal out yeah, and make a good team? Yeah. You need that kind of balance. Like Lauren naturally is pretty high strung. Yeah. And I'm naturally pretty laid back. That's a good so one. it kind of works pretty well together. Yeah. So we, she, I kind of she stresses out enough for the both of us so I think it's kind of grounded <laughs> well at least that's what I like to think I do yeah um but yeah you need to have that kind of if you're both sitting you get a lot of moments where you're both sitting there just like, <laughs> and you're like sitting there up in your head and everything's totally. firing but you can't come up with anything um but yeah you kind of need to balance each other out because that it's not necessarily something you need to look for yeah but it's something that you sort of when things are working it's something that sort of happens totally. See, I always try and find someone that's really good at Adobe Suite, just so that they yeah. like, <laughs> equal me out, and I'm like, oh my god, I can learn off you. Yeah. Um, what's the worst experience you've had even in uni? That's cool. Even in uni? Yeah. Um, oh, I had to do, it's just the joint, the thing that annoys me is when, like, another person you're working with just doesn't do anything. Oh my Standard god. Standard uni stuff. Yeah. Um, so, I'm trying to think of worst experience I've had in the industry. There's a lot of client amends and a lot of nonsense, like, um, yeah, just weird feedback. Weird. <laughs> but probably the worst thing is just like when people don't pull their weight. Like we had to do a 3,000 weight essay in uni and we split it up between the two of us and she just didn't. And I was like, yeah. But like, the fact that I'm having a pretty hard time thinking of worst experience must be that's saying something, true, right? That's true, that's true. And then what's the best experience? Um, probably getting, we did a little campaign for Slurpee. Yeah. 
and it's now on the Isobug Global website. Whoa, that yeah. is pretty cool. As like that's so cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Congratulations on that. Um, it was just like a little Instagram thing. Yeah. And we did it for like 30k budget. And now it's like one of the things that we put into awards and like put it into onto no the way. website. And I was like, oh shit, I'm actually okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool. Um, but yeah, that was that was probably one of the, the better things I've done. And we got to do these cool videos um, for Census called Don't Ask Susan. Yeah. And we made this ridiculous character called Susan and all the crazy marketing ideas. That's that was really fun. Cool. That's but working cool. on the sets was a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, so what should I look for in a copywriter? If you can play the saxophone, look for a dude who can play the saxophone. Yeah. No, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Someone, it's it's copy and the art direction and everything of it kind of comes secondary to the ideas. Like, yeah. if you've got an idea that revolves entirely around puppets, then it mightn't be actually an idea, it might just be yeah. an execution. So, if you can actually distill what that core idea is together yeah. and then work on you, your individual crafts together, yeah. that'd be excellent. So someone that you can bounce off really well. Yeah. And then also someone that's just obsessed. Like, it yeah. gets art directors and copywriters get to the point where they're just tweaking, like, yeah. where they put words and, like, if we want to say every or each and things like that. Yeah. Like, tiny little details that probably aren't seen by anyone else but copywriters. Totally. And you want someone that's kind of just a little bit crazy. It's yeah. Because they're the ones that are fun to work with and also really good at what they do. True, that's a good point. And your words of wisdom for my quest to find my other half. Oh jeez. I'm feeling the pressure. I'm a copywriter. I'm supposed to be good at words. <laughs> no, sorry. Um, work on something together. Yeah. Because you're not going to know how good that, like, no. Young Lions or enter, enter fucking every award you can, first yeah. of all. That's how you get in. Um, but work on something together because you won't know what it's like to actually work on something when you get a job totally. if you haven't done it before. That's a good point. And also just make a whole lot of shit. Whatever yeah. you're interested in, just do it. Just make it. People are interested in stuff that people are doing outside of advertising because yeah. everyone's got side projects. Yeah, totally. Passion projects yeah. and that whole thing. Yeah. Or that, that whole shebang. Totally. Yeah. Awesome.